All right, so this is my review of Bushwick, uh, and this is the part where I try to attempt uh, to say but end up butchering uh, Dave Bozista's um, name. Uh, I've done a couple, two or three other reviews of uh, his movies, and I have always just never said his name so uh, properly. Um, I can't be the only one on that. So it also starts, I believe, Brittany Snow. Um, I swear I've seen her in some other films before. This one in particular is a low budget but shot for well movie. Um, I wouldn't say it's apocalyptic. I would say, um, I mean, without giving you spoilers, it's definitely a, an invasion movie on American soil. Um, I think somewhere in Brooklyn. Um, now I'm not really familiar if that's a city or what. Um, yeah, it has to be a city, right? Or a district or something. Um, you know, I, I, I never been over there and I only know a certain amount of stuff. So, um, despite me being on here, uh, living for 31 years, um, I didn't do well good in school. So I, history wise, I learned stuff more through, um, democ democracy, democracy, uh, you know, well, you know what I mean? Um, this is something that would definitely be something, the quality of this is something that would be on YouTube. And I mean, in the good way, I mean, like nowadays you see a lot of, uh, uh, talented people doing short films that are really good. That should be, you know, big films. Um, and then they'll, some of the time they, they end up being, um, usually horror films are ended up to being that like lights out and whatnot. I never see those. I don't watch those kind of things. Um, but definitely a, a very well talented director and, uh, uh, photographer in this, um, there, there's definitely a lot of good shots. It's not like aerial from above kind of particular big. I mean, they had them from the helicopter, um, but I mean, like with, from a drone kind of thing, that's not what they did. A lot of it is this very clean shots of a movie. So there's a part in there in, um, in the hallway that the, them two are going up and the camera's behind them. Right. And so as they turn the corner, you, you get the whole turn of them like that. And I thought that was pretty cool and really uh, talented of them to do that. Um, and another one is, so there's this, there over here is a, a bunker and across the street there is a, a, a fenced off area. And so these guys go over the fence and they go all the way into the, um, the bunker, right? And so it was far away, and then it slowly went in. And as soon as they hit inside the door, you can go into the door, and it uh, just really cool shot. And there was a whole bunch of that in between this. And I, they had definitely had to shut off a whole bunch of streets and routes, uh, certain places, because uh, there's a lot of space. It's not like it's a shot in a sort of space like a lot of movies are. It was shot in a whole lot of different streets, and it was really cool. Um, they, I'm not going to tell the ending, but as cool as it was, I'm not a fan of the ending. But this was definitely a, a well-done film. Uh, definitely would strongly suggest it. Um the acting was great, except for the one character, the sister in here, um, the character, I don't know about her acting, but the character in here just felt like it was just put in there for dramatic, dramatic effect, um, drugged and, you know, trying to get in Bo's East's pants. It was just, and now the way she went around it didn't fit. Um, but there was only, that's only like 10 minutes in there. I would say even maybe, yeah, about 10 minutes. Um, I didn't like that part, but for the most part, I, I, this is a great movie and I give this five out of five stars. Um, it is on Netflix right now. 
Um, I had issues trying to watch this in the middle of it because the, the server keep crashing on me. And so I had to keep watching the same part about six times. Um, but that's going to happen with the server when people are going on it. Anyways, that's my review. Um, please like the video and please subscribe if you have not. And, um... Maybe I'll watch another movie this afternoon. I don't know. I got to go eat. Um, and then I'll see. Um, yeah, I mean, have a great day, everyone. And um, think positive. <laughs>